glimpse of nature. Like a sip of water to parched lips, Major Hera. Baldurians think all druids to be hay-haired idlers, Halsin. Perhaps we ought not to speak of nature, but uh, high art or politics. I think on them also, but nothing matches the splendor of an ancient tree. It is so. And should one favor bear form, that tree in particular makes for excellent back scratching. Beyond that gate is the upper city, housing the great and the good of Baldur's Gate. Breeze must be blowing in land today. You yearn for Bringing a better the class of company, Astarium. Belching smoke, metal screeches. <laughs> God's name. Who'd want to spend time with any ass. great or good? I have no love for this sea. But the city would not be what it is without these ships. That lends them a kind of beauty, I suppose. Indeed. There is no more impressive sight than a Githyanki spell gem with its astral sayings on Ten days. Maybe more. A sweeter sight still. The world those ships might make if you plied them between the planes. Interplanar learning. Trade. Why stoop to barter when you have the power to take what you need? 